Hi everyone, my name is Ellen and this is the tarot reading for Gemini for October. And today we're gonna start with the tarot Rider White. So three cards from here. Let's see what the universe will bring you in October for Gemini. I wish you all the best. Right. Uh, it's a great start. We're having the high rank card, the star. Uh, the star that is wishes come true. Um, everything you want to achieve, you will achieve. Um, it's um, appreciation, it's uh, progress. This card saying, uh, believe in yourself, believe in your dreams. Dream big, dream bold. Don't, don't stop yourself, don't limit yourself. Don't um, the sky that doesn't have no limits. Uh, your your dreams, your wishes shouldn't have no no limits. So this is a very great start for you, Gemini. Please dream big, dream bold. I hope all your wishes will come true. I wish you that. Um, we'll see what next. King of Cups. King of Cups is a, a most likely person. Um, maybe this person gonna be around. Maybe this is. Maybe you will meet the person you were dreaming about, um, because this person is very full of uh, love, uh, very, very emotional. Uh, very overwhelming. So maybe he is the one who gonna make your wishes come true, or maybe he is part of your wish, because that's most likely a man. Uh, or simply you know somebody, somebody like this, and is gonna be involved in your in your life. Uh, let's see. Let's see what else. Uh, you have grow great cards so far. And uh, we're having um, six, six of wands. Uh, six of uh, wands card of a triumph. Like I said, please dream because you must. Um, uh, it's just cards like that. You can't ignore them. So you're going to be here basically on the horse. You're going to be on the top. You're going to be here. Um, greeted, you're gonna be welcomed. Uh, people are gonna be happy for you. Here you having the uh, the crown made of the uh, laurels. This is the you are in charge. You are in charge of a uh, situation, whatever that is. You are the leader. A leader that who is welcomed, a leader who is uh, followed, and a leader who is listened. Uh, so you're gonna be on the top of the world here. Um, people gonna recognize you, so you might be become famous if if that's what you were trying to achieve. Um, so that could be fame. This card will say, believe in yourself uh, and don't be afraid. So it's a great card so far. Next, we're gonna use the Dark Mansion Tarot. See what they say. Uh, what does they prepare for Gemini's? Let's see. And Four of Pentacles. Uh, Four of Pentacles will say to us that uh, money-wise you're going to be fine, you're going to be stable. But don't, um, the card will say, don't be, mm, we can say it, don't be greedy. Or don't uh, hold all. Don't be focused only on material things. 
don't be like, no, this is mine, 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 and I don't want to give it to anybody, I don't want to share with money, I don't want to lose, this is all I have, this is all what's... No, this is not important, because uh, with Four of Pentacles, you need to remember that maybe what all you achieved, um, you achieved it with the support, uh, with the other people. So, you cannot be uh, this, this full of pride that is only... You, your achievement is only you can enjoy that because if you if you're gonna if you're gonna act like this the universe will the next step is five of pentacles and five of the of pentacles is situation where you might lose uh, everything your material things you will have trouble with money so yes enjoy it you are stable you're fine but just Mm, be kind uh, and don't hold on to material things. Life is more, more, more to it than than that. Uh, we'll see what else. But you in a great. Uh, I mean, so far you have great cards. So nothing to worry about. And then you have Hermit, high rank card. Uh, this card is a card of isolation. Um, uh, you would maybe you would want to be alone. Maybe all of this, what was the beginning, all all of this um, victory parades, everything uh, being top of the world. Maybe that was too much and. You would like to um, step step back uh, and dedicate time to yourself. Spend time alone. Um, make a journey to your soul and see what it, it's really important. Um, what it's, it is really worth it. Uh, yes, you here you would like to um, meet one-to-one -one, uh, with yourself, one-to-one -one with your soul. Um, and also, or maybe you would let, decide to, to go and uh, learn something, study something um, deeper, so you're going to dedicate all your time, all of your attention to, uh, attention to it. Mm. Or maybe you're simply going to go to the library, but like I said, uh, maybe study something. Something you want uh, deeper knowledge about. Uh, oh, you're gonna look for meaning of life uh, for yourself. Maybe you have these questions in your head. One more card from here is oh, ten of swords. Ten of swords. Um, So, first of all, Ten of Swords is end of the cycle. If you had some difficult situation, it will end. But um, this card also saying that you might be in that difficult situation. You might be like feeling like stabbed in the back. Maybe it's very unexpected. Um, and it's going to be quite painful. Uh, but you need to remember that, like I said, it's, uh, it's the end of the cycle. This will end and you will start from the beginning. And also, you need to remember that after every dawn is the sunrise. Yes, it might be difficult. Yes, it might be painful. Yes, you might feel disappointed. Yes, you might feel hurt. Um, and I, I pass through this uh, card. Like I said, yes, this is all I, I named for. But you will look at life with, with different shape, with different uh, perception. You you will understand, and that's going to be ease, ease up. So, something will end, 
I will take one more card from here uh, to see what's next. Next is the Empress, the high rank card. So whatever is gonna be, um, you're gonna feel a bit down, you're gonna be a bit hurt. The great things are ahead. The Empress is, the Empress is, she's on top of the world also because she is in charge. Uh, she is in great shape. She is in great health. She have everything she wants. She is a ruler. She is ruling together with the Emperor. She is the mother. So, yes, actually, you might um, uh, expect a child uh, with this card. Um, but she is ruler. She is um, on the same level with the nature. She is, she is in charge. So, this card, card of abundance. So... Next, we're going to use the Gilded Tarot. So, nothing to worry about. Like I said, uh, life is zebra crossing. And after the black stripe is always the white. Through difficult situation, we are growing. Remember that. And Five of Cups. We're having five of cups. Yes, you um, might feel uh, emotional after after everything. Uh, emotionally down, emotionally hurt, um, disappointed maybe in uh, in the relationship, maybe disappointed in love. Um here maybe you are ready to give up you don't want you don't want anything uh you feel very down but you uh, don't stay in this situation for too long because not everything is um as bad as you think as bad as you feel because uh universe gives us uh is too much chances behind us if you have a look Yes, three cups are down, but two are up. You just need to um, pay more attention. Uh, turn, turn around and see who is willing to support you and help you to go through the difficult times. Maybe, yes, maybe you're going to feel uh, like somebody will betray you in a very unexpected way. Here, maybe you're going to think why, you're going to look for the answers, and like I said, feel emotionally down. Um, but the rest of the cards you have great, so I'm sure you can do it, you can get through it. See, what else? Nine of Pentacles. Oh, uh, this is the great card. Uh, this is card saying of enjoying life, actually, uh, in material way. So money-wise, you you're gonna be more than stable. You're gonna be quite well off. And another card of um, representing a pregnancy, actually. So Empress, and on this particular card, Nine of Pentacles, a woman is ready to give birth. Or because it's ending of the, this is a culmination of the cycle. Maybe this is woman, she collects her rewards. So you're going to be finally rewarded for your hard work. So this is again, like maybe like a give birth, but not in a physical way as a child, but in your, you're going to be finally rewarded, paid off for your, Hard work. Maybe you're waiting for a while. Um, maybe you're waiting for the nine months, eight months, and it's it's the culmination time when is 
time to get receive this um, your achievements because you're gonna enjoy uh, enjoy your rewards. You you they're gonna be well deserved. This you've been working hard for them, and finally the culmination is over, and you are gonna be enjoying yourself at your best. One more card from this deck. It's and <laughs> we're having nine of cups. Yes, you're gonna be out of your out of your let's say misery, not gonna stay down there too long, which is great. Uh because nine of cups, look at this uh, this person is emotionally happy, is emotionally overwhelmed. Um all of his dreams come true, came true. Emotionally, materially, he's happy. He's uh, surrounding uh, himself with those uh, fulfilled cups, with fulfilled emotions, with fulfilled happiness. That's what I'm wishing you for, guys. And next, we're going to use the Witch's Tarot. So, like I said, life always has ups and downs. Don't... Pay attention. Uh, no, you can get through it. We always can get through it. Part of the experience, part of life. You can do it. Right. And here we have again four of pentacles. You see how different this card is. How different those two images. And again, person feels stable and he feels that he needs to protect, protect his material aspects, protect his belongings, his property, uh, he's as a guard, he's as a, uh, I'm in charge, you won't pass, uh, you need to pass through me to, to get in that door. So, yes, like I said, Money-wise, perfect, um, stable, just don't, um, just don't focus just on material things. Life is more to, to it. Uh, one more uh, card from here. And it's the moon. Look at this one, it's beautiful. The moon will say to us that some situation we don't see, something is hidden from our view, um, something we don't see as it truly is. Our, our mind is uh, a bit cloudy, is a bit foggy with all of this success we had earlier. And this cat will say, use your intuition. Use your intuition, and again, this is the third card that it could indicate pregnancy, actually. Um, but I'm gonna take one more card from here to see what is hidden from from us. What don't we see? What don't we see? Three of Cups. Uh, Three of Cups is usually a card of celebration, or you're gonna meet up with your friends, with your girlfriends. But together with the moon here, maybe you need to pay attention to people who are around you. Um, maybe you don't see that they um, are involved in your life somehow. Um, and they're making a maybe this emotional impact on you or they might simply may they might help you uh, that's you don't see don't see it clear but it's most likely free woman uh, be involved in your life like I said just um, be aware play, play close attention to people um, who are around you who wish you well right and Next, we're going to use the Light Seer Tarot. 
three cards from here. And we have Ace of Wands. Ace of Wands is a great card. Uh, it's a chance from universe from the universe herself. Uh, so chance to be creative, to be uh, artistic. You might have idea just just like this. Suddenly, suddenly you have idea. Suddenly you know what to do. Hold on to that idea. Uh, like I say, always say Aces doesn't stay with us for too long. They are not that often uh, given to us. Mm, so grab it with your both hands, otherwise they will pass by to somebody else. So we'll see. So yes, it's no time to to be down, to be sad, to feel sorry for yourself. Uh, you um, months of action as well, and the temperance. A high rank card and temperance will say to us. Um, that everything under control and uh, everything is under universe control herself the angels they are supporting you they are guide you they are watching you they are helping you everything goes the, the way it's supposed to go uh, you cannot really affect the outcome um, you cannot uh, postpone it or uh, forward it, um, fast forward it, uh, sorry, um, because like I said, universe is in control, universe is uh, keeping everything in the balance, in the right flow, you just need to follow that flow and trust, uh, trust the universe, uh, trust the, your guide, trust the, the angels that, believe me, they know what they're doing, they know what's best for you. Uh, just give that trust in the keep that trust in the capable hands and um, everything will uh, fall into place how it's meant to be one more card from here is the world yes in the end when time comes when Angels know when the time comes, it's going to be end of one cycle of life from one uh, level to the next. So one uh, cycle of your life is finished and you going to the next level, higher level. This is a great card. This is a culmination of everything. Uh, this is could be, this card also means uh, changing the status, going to the next level. So if you uh, maybe just a couple with somebody, you might get married. Or is so many cards here of uh, about the fertility, uh, getting pregnant, uh, having conceive a child. Yeah, again, you changing the status, you becoming a mother, or you becoming a parent. So you stepping up a level, you taking the higher responsibilities. Um, also, this card means you could be go traveling, traveling the world far away, um, maybe moving, moving house, moving country, moving place. Um, basically, the whole world is open to you. This is again another card of your dreams, your wishes coming through. A uh, very interesting um, reading with great, great cards for you, Gemini. So now we ask the angels about for the advice for you. Um, how to behave, what to do best, what to pay attention to. And again, we're having here family and uh, even the small children. Like I said, there's so many cards we're having here with uh, 
possibility of having a child and here angels giving you giving you child and let's see uh, this situation is rooted in emotional experience with a family member which we can help you to understand and heal in your mind and, and heart surround this person yourself and the experience with calming blue light and many angels Beyond, be open to the gifts within the situation and allow yourself to feel peace. Great advice. Focus on the family. Maybe one of your family members will expect a child. Maybe somebody who you know. But yes, remember, focus. The family is most important um, in our lives. And now they ask Nature's Oracle what they want to say to us be in service look at this be in service i would say uh, be be helpful be uh, like i said be open to to people uh, <laughs> try to be stay away from been all closed up be in service if somebody in need if somebody needs your help be in service uh, i hope you enjoyed your reading i wish you all the best uh, please like subscribe leave your comments and uh, check your ascendant uh, as well together with your sun sign because it could uh, work up even stronger for you I'll see you. Uh, I wish you all the best and I'll see you next time. Bye.